The Kansas City Police Department is taking the pledge to add more women to the department. Yeah, the mayor and the uh, inter uh, the mayor and the interim police chief uh, officially announced the 30 by 30 initiative. Kathy Quinn's been on that story all morning long, and she joins us live from police headquarters. Good morning, Kathy. Yes, good morning. So just a few moments ago, they dispersed. We had all we had a bunch of female police officers that were on the stairs there as the mayor and the deputy chief made the announcement that they're going to do this initiative, the 30 by 30, which means they're going to increase the female presence representation within the police department to 30 percent by the year 2030. Now, right now, Kansas City stands at 15 percent, which is pretty good. According to the initiative, there are 12 to 15 percent uh, across the nation. That's the trend of women. So we're right at that or a little bit above. And then as far as women in roles, the leading roles in within the police departments, uh, we're at 15% uh, and the national average is at 3%. So the mayor said that they're going to have some some sessions where they'll be listening to the women in law enforcement to figure out how to get these women in there, recruit them. Some one of the biggest obstacles they talked about was daycare, daycare. That's one of the biggest. So uh, they're going to work on that as well. But this is what the mayor had to say this morning. We are here today proudly and boldly to say that we will lead in departments around the country, not just in having a total number of female officers increased, but also in making sure, as the deputy chief notes, that there are more deputy chief Karen Trues, that there are more leaders, that one day we have a woman police chief, that we have more representation for women in every part of this department and every part of this city. All right, so I spoke to some of the women after, and they did say that, uh, you know, daycare is a big thing. They're working on that. Another thing that they said was kind of an obstacle was the uniforms. They're, they're men pants. And so uh, that's one of the things they're going to talk about, I guess. I don't know if they're going to work on that. But uh, there's some obstacles, and they just want to make sure they're able to keep these women in policing. And so that is the goal is 2030. Back to you in the studio. Oh, my gosh, something as simple as the uniform yeah. itself is made for men only? Nick, I mentioned that at the meeting this morning. Someone asked me, would I be a police officer? I said, no, I don't like their pants. <laughs> I mean, that's what I said, and I didn't even know that was what they Unless they make them in animal print, you can forget it. <laughs> oh, I Kathy. offered to design the new pants. They would be black, tight leather. <laughs> <laughs> Kathy Quinn, you are a treasure. Thank you so much.